The YZ boys lacrosse team hopes to return to the state tournament this week. For one of their key defenders, it would be a third state tournament this school year. In this week's Sports Jam Spotlight, we profile the Trojans' Colin Kubinski. He's a throwback and maybe part of a dying breed, a three-sport athlete, especially at the state's largest high school and in three team sports. Why is that a senior Colin Kubinski, a soccer, hockey, and lacrosse player, wouldn't have it any other way. You know, I feel like it definitely would have helped to focus on one sport, maybe like to for college. Um, but you know, I've I've always wanted to be busy, always never wanted to sit still. So playing three sports growing up was something I love to do, something I'm very yeah, proud of. Um, there, definitely one of my greater achievements through. in life so far. Yeah, why is that? It's pretty tough with so many athletes here. It's really tough if you're not focusing on one sport all year round to be competitive and. Uh, Kind of a you know saying what how good how great of an athlete he is and how great of a leader and you know he's respected well in every sport um, so yeah it's saying a lot that he's he's really a valuable part of our our program for sure. Not only is Kubinski a key contributor in all three sports, he's played in a state tournament in all of them. The Trojans won the Class AA title in hockey his junior season and made it back to state this school year as an underdog with a losing record. He backstopped the Trojans boys soccer team to a runner-up finish as a goalkeeper this past fall and helped the lacrosse team to state a year ago. It's an experience like no other. Um, you know, hockey is definitely a bigger deal here, but being able to play, you know, help my team get to soccer and get to lacrosse is just an awesome experience, and hopefully we'll be able to do that again this year for lacrosse. Colin doesn't play the glamour positions. As a defenseman in hockey and lacrosse and goalie in soccer, he's looking to prevent goals instead of scoring them. I like to tell people I'm not very goal orientated. I like to play defense because that's what, I'm, what I've been uh, growing up and uh, raised to do. So usually just play defense because it's what I'm better at, but I would love to be a goal scorer. I'm just not, I've faced that. Just shows a lot about his character. Um, you know, not, not always having to be the the, the point man on everything, but the guy that kind of is the, the 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 rock that has you know playing goalie in soccer and you know playing you know good defense for us in hockey and I know he plays defense in lax too. It just a, shows his character of just what type of kid he is of the team guy first and and you know has a lot of skill and he's, he's a phenomenal athlete too. He's obviously been a part of strong teams, but Kuminski also appreciates that he and his teammates face the best competition in Minnesota in the Lake Conference and knows that records may suffer, but it helps in the long run. I really appreciate like how our Wyzetta, um creates their seasons. Um, we play tough schedules in all three of the sports that I've played, so our records don't really reflect how good we truly are, and I think we've really proved that the last couple of years I've been here. We've been under 500 some, some years and made it to state, and just proving to teams that having a bad record doesn't mean anything. It's just awesome experience. His playing ability speaks for itself, but Wyzetta's coaches can't say enough about Collins' leadership. Great team player for us. Um, he understood his role as a goalkeeper, um, did a great job this year organizing our defenders in front of him, um, worked with some new defenders. We definitely had some new guys in the back this year, um, and he had a great balance of just giving them the direction that they needed and then controlling his own box. So great organizer of the backs, um, super athlete, just all around great team player. After graduating Friday, Collins getting set to head one state south for college. I'm going to Iowa State to study mechanical engineering. Um, I don't really plan on playing uh, any like club sports as of now, but that may change. Yes, that's right. Three sport athlete Colin Kubinski might go cold turkey. His coaches all say he has the potential to be a college player, but school and his future come first. It's a tough decision for sure. Being on hockey, like a big thing for kids to do is go play juniors. And I just had some talks with my parents about it. They said it was my decision and I really just didn't see um, a reason to do that because like I don't see myself really playing D1 or playing professional so I think just personally I wanted to focus more on school and uh, Iowa State's a good engineering school which is what I know I want to do so I'm very happy with my decision it'll be it'll be a little rough with all my downtime but I think it'll be fun. Kubinski and the Trojans face St. Michael Albertville in the Section 8 lacrosse semifinals Monday a win would put them into Wednesday's final.